Hello. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back for another YouTube video. You're probably thinking, what's going on? This is meant to be a vlog. And it is a vlog, and I'm going to put a timestamp in the description box to when the vlog starts. Because if you're only here to enjoy the vlog, um, then I will put a timestamp. And you don't want to hear me babbling on about nonsense, then you can click when the video starts. But for those of you that maybe want context or a hello um, in real time, or just maybe a bit of an update, that's what this is kind of about. So, as you guys can see, Mimi should go away. Um, there was a lot of controversy about that on Instagram just I don't even want to get into it because I do you know what it is I know that 80% of you guys are you understand where my mindset is but I know there's some people that don't and I didn't realize that I struggle with the negative comments I kind of always thought I was like tough but I don't know getting some of the comments on Instagram has just been like woo um, a little bit overwhelming but that's why I'm doing this context bit of the vlog Anyway, um, we went away, there was no, no one was telling us not to go away, that wasn't the situation when we went, I felt like things have escalated so much whilst we were away, so yeah, there was no reason for us not to go, also, you know, we would have lost all our money for the flights, we've lost all our money, obviously, for our tickets out there, we've lost a lot of money, and I know this situation is not about money, but that is kind of part of the story, isn't it, at the end of the day, um, and there was no reason for us not to go, so we went, just for anyone that cares or is wondering, we stayed in a condo, the two of us, um, and there weren't that many cases in Florida. It wasn't to the level of what it's got to and also what the UK has got to, just, just, just for context. I feel like anything I say is gonna not sit well with most people. So I'm just being really careful about what I say. What's done is done. We're home. We're like not leaving our houses, the pair of us. So we're home, we're here, you know, it's been and gone. But if you are interested, enjoy the vlog for what it is um, and, you know, try and spread love. I feel like it's the internet has really gone from everyone kind of promoting that, like, spread love and positivity to kind of, like, a little bit of a dark place. I felt that way anyway. Um, and, you know, I have grandparents that live in Spain that I'm very close with that are on lockdown out there. So I am just as concerned as other people. I think people think that I don't care just because I was trying to get out of the States. I do care. I'm also like, I don't wanna encourage scaremongering and I don't wanna stress anybody else out. It's not my place to do that. So it's just finding that balance and I think that can be quite difficult, but keeping it real with you guys and telling you how I am feeling right now and just, I'm just trying to be real. I'm trying to talk to you how I would talk to my friends at the end of the day. Um, and everyone has a difference of opinion and everyone does things differently. So yeah, so I'm obviously just as concerned my grandparents are out there. They're on lockdown right now and they're elderly. Um, so yes, and a lot has just kind of been going on since I got back into the UK. Um, you know, when I arrived home, I got some sad news about a family member. Um, so yeah, but I, that's, you know, that's just a side thing, but just, it's just been a, a lot to get the nasty negative messages on Instagram and trying to obviously deal with the situation. I apologize if I offended anyone with this. Um, I don't really know I don't really know what the right thing is to say. I'm just trying to say something to preface this. Now, following on from here, I am gonna be uploading. I'm gonna be uploading as much as I can. I'm at home, I can do content. Please, please let me know any video suggestions in the description box. Um, I'd love to hear what you guys want me to film and create for you. Yes, I'm sending all of you love, light, positivity, health, um, all of that good stuff. You know, we all are in this situation together and um, I'm gonna be posting content because it gives you guys maybe something to watch if you're really insanely bored. I mean, I'm gonna clear out my cupboards and probably watch every single YouTube video that ever existed. So yes, that's just my little commentary on it. Uh, I'm waffling. I'm not articulating myself in the best way because I didn't write down things that I wanted to say. I just wanted to just speak. So it's probably a mess this bit, but I hope you guys are well. I love you all. Hello. That was way too exposed. Hello. So, as you guys have seen from the title, this is my vlog. I was meant to start this yesterday, but let's just be real. Let's just be honest. I was in the airport, pretty lazy, so tired and exhausted, and I just thought it wasn't that 
nothing wildly you know exciting was going on if you do want to see what we did at the airport though i'm pretty sure it will be on misha's vlog here oh, yeah, she comes you can go and see it in mine you can go and see it in hers so we'll leave a link to that below but we are here we're in the us of a hi hello here hello. we are love that red lip is that the ysl one uh no i've lost that one. Oh, that's really nice that one it's like it's a blue beauty mm, nice so we are here we are in florida we we're actually staying at my parents condo out here um which my mum actually does rent out so i will leave a link to it in the description box when we've left so if you guys are interested in staying for a bit or maybe you live in the states or you know someone that would want to um you can check it out but yeah we are staying here the two of us for 10 days we have got so much planned so much to do it's a bit stressful <laughs> she looks very like she's hiding something in the corner I'm no, it's so fine money. I don't know why I always think <laughs> oh. people couldn't read my no, money and no, one can, and no one can see either like, I've wow been she's got some five dollars <laughs> <laughs> so anyway we are dressed we are ready we're gonna go out today is a little bit cloudy and grey in Florida the weather's yeah. very temperamental here so we are gonna go to the mall today and the um, premier the international it's outlets nearly one o'clock so we're not doing awful. yeah we're not doing awful we've unpacked everything we've sorted our lives out i would show you this room but it is slightly chaotic is that right now we don't have any important information lying around. i don't think i did that's what i thought but i don't think we do. we do and then this is our little wardrobe that we've definitely filled this out so this is my section Shop and this is mish no but what cracks me up is mine is so white oh, and mine is so colorful but like yeah you're white. wearing colors i'm wearing nude yeah that's true so I mean, look at this girl's shoe situation. It's actually killing me off. That's I've mine. Five, That's hers. But I've got these ones on that I think I um, really, really love. They're from this girl called Lara Customs or something. She does like custom ones. They're cute. So that was that. And then this is the bathroom. Here we are. You said bathroom so weirdly then. No, I said it in a northern accent. Oh yeah. It's the bathroom. So if anyone's wondering, this top is from Shein. It's quite old now. Um, but they might still have something similar if you're interested. Cardigan is a pretty little thing and it has this little tie at the top. It's really cute. Belt is Zara. Jeans are white fox. Yes, they are white fox. What's that? So we're going to go. Here she is. What's your outfit of the day, doll? Jeans, PLT. pretty little thing. PLT. A little bit of PLT. Wow. Oh, we've really got some energy now, even though I don't know how because we've had nothing to eat. Yeah, literally. But we're gonna go, we're gonna have our apply, we're gonna go to the shops. We will catch up with you guys. I'm actually beach. Florida, there's Cocoa Beach, that's oh, a drive. Yeah. Also, I am so excited to buy stuff, like you guys have no idea. I might include some of the stuff in this video or I might do a separate like Orlando haul, so we'll see. I'm hoping that I don't buy enough that I have to do an America haul. I'm telling myself you're not buying and you don't. Because you are the worst. You encourage shopping. I love shopping. And I need to be saving money right now. <laughs> so I decided to come on my Nintendo's. Yeah. I will um, check in with you guys when we get to the shops. I vlog. So we have arrived at the mall. And we just went and got this very dramatic music going on, by the way. Yeah, Sorry. Really it sounds like the music in Frozen. Why the surfer? No, she's like, ah. Oh, no. And I just got my salad and I just wanted to be cocky and share it with you guys. So. I have gone for everything but the kitchen sink. Mm. Um, I randomly got some salmon just because I was like, do you know what, it'll fill me up. I haven't had salmon in ages, but let's give it a whirl. Misha's got hers there. She's got some strawberries going on, some cranberries, some sandwich tomatoes and some chicken. I can't see the name of the place. It's Bistro called- Bistro Europa. There we go, Bistro Europa. Anyway, we're gonna sit here, have something to eat, and then we need to hit the shops. Hello everyone. So we're actually leaving them all. So that was very short-lived, you didn't even see us in here. We grabbed ourselves a Starbucks, had yes. a bit of a mooch about, and I did buy some, purchases. some underwear from Victoria's Secret, because they had five, six, no, sorry, buy three, get three free. So six for the price of three, basically. Yes. And, and I just really, can't to figure it out. I really need some underwear. We are going to go to the outlet, which does, I really did need some underwear. G does not need any I don't more. Like, I don't like keeping old raggedy underwear. Okay, G literally has a cupboard the size of like your entire house full of bras and pants that she never wears. I have a drawer. The drawer is huge. So, we're going to the outlet, which also has a Victoria's Secret, which I really, which I'm buzzing really do recommend. They have honestly everything in there. However, they're really limited on my size in underwear. But they I never have a large. Size as you, so. It is. It is a bit more of a struggle. It depends on the fit you like and the fabric. Sorry, I don't want extra small pants going right up my. I know. Like, I know. Sorry, I find it uncomfortable. I know. So we're gonna have a look at what they've got, but um, I'll vlog in there because it might be a bit easier. Just at the mall, it's a bit awkward. But we just pulled our Uber, um, and we're gonna be on our way. We went shopping. 
we went, this is the first shop we've been in, by the way. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, we've been there for ages. The first store we went in. What time is and it? And the guy was so nice. He was oh, like, you can have a little bit of extra discount. So oh, yeah, he was a babe. He was a babe. We got us some good deals in there. Yeah, we did. I got three tops for $30. Three! I'm Literally them. wild. Yeah, Literally. it was the champion store. So we got some good finds. What's this old loft? So anyway, we're at the outlets now. I actually really like this outlet. There's two outlets in the Orlando area. And is this your favourite one? Do you know what it used to be? It used to be mm -hmm. absolute favourite. I used to get nothing from the other one. And now I buy loads of stuff from the other one. Okay, well, I'll be the judge. So you know? I'll let you know. We'll let you guys know. This is the one we're in. I'll spin you around so you can see where we are. Sunnies. Here we go. So look, it's like half inside, half outside. It's a little bit unusual. It's like a nicer version of popping in um, Las Vegas. Yeah. Because I find Las Vegas too inside. Yes. Yeah. There is an outlet centre at Las Vegas, which is incredible. Oh, really? Yeah, I went on my own. And it was great. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, okay. Bye, everyone. Is it in the strip? No, you have to get a cab. Uh, that's so, yeah, we've already done a bit of damage and we've only been here for 15, 20 minutes. So, we'll see what else we get. I think this is going to be a bit of a shopping day, but it's grey outside. What else are we supposed to do? Literally. Here's my piece of tooth floss. It's cute, though. Big for a small. Really cute. These are cute. These sport shorts. As you guys can see, we are in Victoria's Secret right now. Hello, vlog. We're back. So, this is my outfit. Let's quickly just show it to you guys. This cardigan is a pretty little thing. This dress is from a store out here actually called Threads, but it's by a brand. So, I'll try and link it because I remember it was on Do Dolls Kill for a little bit. Um, so, if I, I can. Well, this isn't Threads, they stock other brands as well so this is another brand I think they're called cotton candy or something um, and then I've got Misha shoes on today and these little Nike <laughs> socks what really badly <laughs> and then I'm bringing my Chloe bag <laughs> and Misha's ripped a dress <laughs> my bum is too big turn around though because it's really not that bad it's at the bottom, you really can't see it. Oh, How nice is this dress, by the way, everyone? Nasty girl. Nasty girl. It's literally, honestly, it's, it's black, so it's flipping stock. cute. So we have arrived at Disney Springs. We had a mad dash, we went to Threads, which is a store that I love, but I couldn't find anything. This is great light when you did that. Um, so we've come to the boathouse, we're gonna have a nice drink. We've got a tablecloth for a blanket. The guy is lovely. There it is above, and I'm gonna show you guys the view because it's 10 out of 10. Sunny, here's my camera lady, right here with the light. This is what we're looking at. I mean, how romantic for our first evening together. So nice. And this is the little bar. Honestly, I'm screaming. We've been given these tablecloths, I can't breathe. But yeah, we're gonna grab some food. Look, you could use it around the back where it rips. <laughs> Drinks have arrived. I've gone for the sangria. And it's absolutely sunny, 10 out of 10. Oh, Misha's lost her phone, sorry, Dale. And Misha's gone for this strawberry kind of number. Drink, what's it called? What's that one called that you've got? Strawberry something or other. I'm gonna try it, everyone. Oh, it's like a mojito, strawberry mojito. Yeah. Yum. Anyway, we've just ordered by this lovely man over here. He's fantastic. Here we are, lads. Sorry, Our food's arriving. <laughs> Potatoes going in right now. <laughs> so we both got the fish sacos. And then I got a like jacket, like a regular potato, and Mish got a sweet potato. Is that like a balsamic glaze? That looks like some sort of like sticky kind of glaze going on. A size salad she got went for, because obviously I get the little chips. There we go. Here we go. Hello everybody, welcome back to the vlog. Today, we have made it to Universal. We're only a little bit late. Very late, basically. Um, we went to bed at about two and we literally did not get out of bed or get on an escalator until nine. There she is. There she comes. Some of you guys might have seen I actually came here last Easter. I think I've got a vlog on my channel from Universal, which will probably be a little bit more in depth because this is just, you know, to add to this vlog of yesterday's events. But um, yeah, I'm very, very excited. We need to go get some coffee though. I need, a, yeah. I need some fuel. I'm not making any sense right now. I think I want a warm one. Yeah. So, the hair is up. Please excuse this hairstyle that I've I got going on. I need to put mine up as well. Really don't know what's going on right now. We have just got off the Simpsons ride. The sun is, like, it's really weird. It's humid. It's and always the sun humid is in this bright. Way, yeah. yeah. So, we're just looking for somewhere to get something to eat. Me, she's a bit peckish. And I wouldn't mind getting a drink. Yeah. So, we're, we're trying to many have a little look. But you know what Universal's like? Oh my god, look, we can get matching braids. Oh my god, we can get tattoos. Um, well, I, I hope. 
Oh my god, I'd actually get a little braid in my hair. I know, it's so cute, right? So do I. A better version of what I've got going on. They're hair. really cute. Um, so anyway, we're trying to find something to eat. So, we just tried to get some pictures. Like, I've seen them on Pinterest, they're really cute. On the cars. We got told off. On the cars. Oh my god, Scooby Doo and all the team are here. Stop. See, Scooby, I can deal with the car face mask -y thing on. But yeah, no one else. So yeah, anyway, we got in trouble, but now we're walking down a little bit. I think this is meant to be LA. Yeah. Los Angeles, I'll spin the, the camera around. I don't think it looks very LA, very but I've never cute. been to LA. I have, actually. Can't really remember. <laughs> <laughs> this road is, though, with all the palm trees, defo. Yes, yeah. So, so we get the photo of two of Yes, I think this is where we get the photo of two of us. Well, Sorry, everyone. Goodbye, we're gonna love and leave you. Hello guys, so we actually just finished eating. Sorry I didn't show you what I had. There was a bit of a mishap, mishap? mishap. with the order, but we got there in the end. Um, I'm just finishing my very artificial coloured Fanta. Literally, that is like radioactive, that colour. So we've decided we're gonna get the train to Islands of Adventure. King's Cross. King's Cross. Very excited, it's a really cute little train. It's quite fun in there. Really? Yeah, it's kind of cute. People love it. So we want to get in and get out. Anyway, I'm gonna finish this. Hello everyone. So, we have made it to the train station, back in London town. Oh, here we go. Here we go. This is a very, very amusing sight. This is obviously meant to be like King's Cross. And it is like King's Cross, but as me and Mish pointed out, it's much cleaner than King's Cross. Very much cleaner. Yeah. But it'll be fun. That's this, rude. <laughs> this takes you from um, Universal Studios Park to Islands of Adventure, so that's where we're going to go and do. I'm also cradling about 50 things, so yeah. I need to go and sort myself out. Hello, vlog. Also, hello, mum. Please do not judge this. I promise you we will tidy it up. So, this is my outfit and I just want to chat with you guys really, really quickly. Um, my dress is from Princess Polly. I've got a hair in my mouth. Hang on. This dress is Princess Polly. It's really, really cute. I got it um, last year, but I reckon they might have something similar or same kind of shape because that's what I really love about it. I've then got these ears on that Mish kindly gave me for my birthday. These are from Hannah Marie Magic, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, so, I'll link that below. Then I've got my Chloe bag. I got for Christmas and then for my shoes I've got these from Zara well, so nice. there we go right we're gonna go because I need to out the Uber bye everyone here's Misha's outfit by the way hi bye hello vlog welcome back oh, the sun's out the sun is out so I didn't end up bringing my camera last night um <clears throat> didn't really fit in my handbag if I'm being honest and also I kind of did just want a night you know, no camera, you guys know I go through this sometimes. I love filming everything, but I just have these little phases where I'm like, do you know what, I don't need to vlog tonight, it's really not that wild. And also, obviously I know Misha's filming this whole trip, so anything that I kind of miss out, hopefully she'll have and sort of vice versa, because we are trying to film, I thought I heard like a creature, I think it's just like the leaves moving. Um, so yeah, hopefully we will have like obviously different things on our vlogs, because we're trying our best to kind of do that, but, if you do want to see what we did last night, it will be on her vlog video. Um, we just went to Epcot. We went on Soarin', which is one of my favourite rides, Epcot, if you're going to go. It is so, like, a feel-good ride. Um, and then we went and had, we saw the fireworks, had a couple of drinks in the pub, in, like, the English bit. And then we went to Disney Springs, grabbed a pizza, like, a very sort of chilled kind of dinner. We've woken up today and we are on our way to Disney Springs again. We're having some technical issues with editing and uploading videos. So we're trying to kind of resolve that by going to a Starbucks. Fingers crossed it's gonna solve all of our problems. I'm yet to believe that it will, but we'll see what happens. Then to be honest, I wouldn't mind coming back and sitting by the pool because it is a really nice day. Hopefully it stays like this. Blue, blue skies. I'll spin the camera around and show you guys. The little outfit that I'm wearing is from Boohoo. It's just a little play suit. You know me, I'm not one for play suits, but I'm trying to go out of my comfort zone. Um, and yeah, we're going to go and do a bit of work and just, just chill, really. So let me spin the camera around so you guys can see the blue, blue skies. What, nice. So yeah, this is like the little view that you've got from the balcony area in the house. Um, so it kind of just looks like this. There's obviously the golf course there. And then you can see the other houses. Oh, somebody's running. Um, and there, around there. So yeah, it's really, really lovely. Sun is out and I'm so happy about it. So yeah, we're gonna go get ourselves together and I'm sure I'll bring you guys with us um, for the day, whatever we get up to. This is Misha's outfit, I don't know if everyone who's interested. 
<laughs> which we can figure out when. <laughs> it's less bad and they're both as bad. It's because in one. the restaurants it gets really chilly. So I feel like she needs something. Option one. This is option one, everyone. Love this though. Where's this from? Nasty girl. This is lovely. Thanks. Okay. Um, this is option two. <laughs> I'm the, actually now I'm starting to think option two. In my head, option two looked okay. Better. And I put it on and then it looked horrendous. <laughs> no, no, no. You're, you need to turn the thing up. It's because it's oversized. It doesn't. Like no, a... no. It's oversized, and I'm wearing a dress with a pair of shorts. <laughs> tie that in a bow, just if you did get freezing. Could you tie that in a bow or something? <laughs> <sighs> no. Not really. <laughs> Could you, yeah, and do like a bow at the back? like Or like tuck it in and have it like draping out. <laughs> you know, kind of like a tail. Could you have that? Like kind of like a... Hang on. <laughs> like tuck it in and then have... I feel like maybe that. Like if you get freezing, <laughs> if you get freezing cold. From the front, look absolutely fine. <laughs> from the back, <laughs> this is mine. She looks lovely. <laughs> no, Misha's outfit's lovely. It's in case, I'm worried she's gonna get chilly in the restaurant and she's gonna need a cardigan. Cause it gets so chilly in the restaurants. <laughs> Your face of concern. <laughs> Do I look genuinely like You look baffled, human? <laughs> perplexed. So yeah, um, this is from PLT, this is from Zara. They Zara. Are awful. What do I do? Right, I'm gonna help her with her dilemma. Hello, it's me. Right, fuck, I'm so sorry. Today I've been very, very distant with you guys, but I'm back now. Brought you out tonight, being generous. <laughs> so we have stopped off at Yard House. I've actually been here before. Um, it's in Icon Park, which is on International Drive. And it's just very cute. It's kind of like got a few bars and like a few, oh, I don't know, would you say shops? I don't really know. Um, Got a little like stalls. Yeah, kind of thing. Just got a bit of atmosphere, I guess. I am having an apple as we can see. It's a really, really yummy one. I'm here with a lovely mini shop, obviously. No, she replaced me. She's rocked up. So, we're by the wheel. That is mammoth, actually. The thought of being right at the top of that doesn't really sit very well with me. I agree. I wouldn't really be like, oh my god, let's go up. Yeah. We've got some guac, as always. My favourite. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Our favourite. And then we've got some water because we're being sensible. Just kidding. Um, and then drink our drinks. I thought that was another one. Then I realised it was some water. So, I'm zoomed in. Let's zoom out. Oh, I'm having some technical issues. There's Misha over there. Should have zoomed in for that. How is it? She's got this special vegan burger moment. Good, bad, middle. Good. Okay, we finished the guac as you can see. That went down a treat. We've asked for the same drinks again. And I have gone for these fish tacos. I've had them before, I do actually enjoy them. And then I've also got spicy rice and some beans. There we go. Hello everyone. We're in a bar. Maggot. And it is so country vibes in here, like the actual bar. I'm so happy, I feel like I'm in a movie. This is highly amusing. Oh, we're about to finish. Oh, no, they're leaving the stage. They're leaving the stage. That's a shame. Oh. Bye, doll. This guy's sweet. I'm playing the guitar. Bless his soul. It's a live music joint. Oh, oh, wow. It's going in the sky. The guitar's in the sky. The guitar's in the sky. The guitar's in the sky. It's a little play. I'm screaming. I'm screaming. I'm here to get my story straight, my friends are in the bathroom getting higher than the M5. I freaking love this song. Yeah, we'll see you Hello everybody. So, as you saw yesterday evening, we did head to that little kind of country bar moment. So, yeah, we had a couple of beers, chilled out, um, and then we came back here, um, sorted out our video stuff and all of the technical boring stuff woke up this morning got ready and now we are gonna head out hello vlog welcome back currently in a car park i won't be in here for long and we're zoomed in what is going on today here's little mish hey we've got the ears on we've actually just arrived at magic kingdom it is about it's half boiling. 10 yeah, it is boiling and hopefully we can get some sun this afternoon so we're gonna go and explore magic kingdom i'm very excited i haven't been to magic kingdom since i was probably about 10 years old so this should be fun. We are everyone. We made it inside. We got on the monorail. We're here. 
can't see anything, eh? So that's what's Anyone who's watched our Paris vlogs, this is a bit deja vu right oh, now. Oh, don't, it really is. Because obviously we're in Magic Kingdom, but it's a little bit different. When we were in our Paris vlogs, we were in about 50 layers, oh, yeah. woolly hats, gloves, the works. Right now we've got, you know, sporting a bit of a different attire. Um, but we have made it. Let me spin you guys around. Dun, 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 dun. What are all these people queuing for? There's a crane that's now rocked up. Thank goodness we were here when we were here. We managed oh to get God, some. We literally. We literally that. Sorry, that was like. That was so lucky. We just got some pictures here. I don't know how we didn't get in trouble because we did jump on this railing to sit here to get no, some good. I literally nearly She's so course. brave. But now this has turned up. So thank goodness we did it when we did it because now there's two cranes actually all over the no, whole building. No, 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 no. Yeah. So, since we last spoke, we took some pics without the cranes. Tried our best. Then we went and got a Starbucks. And now we're just sat outside the bathroom. Quite pleasant. Um, no British room needed the loo. We are gonna go now and look around. I really wanna go on like it's a small world or like a pizza pan. Yeah. So something like that, something cutesy, but the wait times seem a little bit ridiculous here. I think it's just so busy in Magic Kingdom. Um, yes, yeah, so it just seems so busy here. Like it does seem a lot busier than elsewhere. Like when we went to Universal, it was not like this. Hello guys, time no see. Misha just started vlogging so it reminded me I should update you all. Mm -hmm. Hair's looking dishevelled, I'm looking dishevelled. The last thing you saw was us in Disney and it didn't last very long. It was a short oh, no, we, we went, but as in we didn't go on any rides. No, literally. Nothing, because all of the queues were crazy, crazy long. Like we're talking like an hour and a half. Mm -hmm. Some of them were longer than that, yeah. Some of them were two hours. Mm. Um, two hour long queues just so many people which is totally our own fault we should have got there even earlier like we've learned that it's fine we're gonna get there really early next time we go we get there like 10 10 30. yeah i think we need to literally get there for nine we're gonna do the fast pass thing before so we'll have like time slots so when we can go on certain rides we're gonna sort ourselves out but we obviously went there to shoot because we wanted to take pictures for instagram and all that good stuff and um there were like eight cranes on Magic Kingdom, like on Cinderella's, Cinderella, Cinderella's Castle, isn't it? And I know it's really not the end of the world, like we said in Misha's vlog, but mm. it, we have spent quite a lot of money, obviously. Well, do you pay for something you expect to get it? I do okay. agree, and also I felt sorry for all the families that are going there, like it's a once in a lifetime thing. They happen to have gone on like the couple months where there's gonna be renovations, which is obviously a little bit, a little bit crap if you've spent all that money. So just something to bear in mind if you're not planning on going very, very soon. Um, but we've come back to the condo. We went and got some salads from Publix. This is lush actually, it's yours mm. good. And we've taken a few pictures here and we're just gonna sit here and chill out. We're by the pool, we're at a different pool today. It's a little bit humid, but the sun does keep peeping out. So yeah, and it's about four o'clock. Is that actually? It's four o'clock, yeah. We're not gonna be hungry for dinner, are we? No, typical. We'll check in with you when we've got a plan. We've got no idea what we're doing this evening. We're gonna have a chat and figure out now. Mm. Hello. It's me, I'm in California. Right, hello everyone. So, we chilled by the pool, kind of realised that we were running very late, have come back, tried to get ready very quickly and it really hasn't happened. So it's now half seven, we haven't eaten anything, we haven't got to Universal, honestly guys. Something happens to us in the summer air, like the warm air, and we just go really chilled out and let me know in the comments if you guys are like that, if you can relate. We just zen out, but we are leaving right now. We're going to Universal. I'm gonna try and fit you guys in my handbag, but I have this horrible feeling you're not gonna fit, so hopefully Misha can fit you in. Otherwise, I might have to insert, include some footage from my phone, which if that's the case, I'm really, really sorry, but this bag is not that big. Let me just show you guys the sunset right now, though, because it's so pretty. This is the sunset, and it's just beautiful. I love little moments like this. Yeah, stunning. To grab some food in Universal, not sure what the two of us are gonna eat, her with her dairy intolerance and me with my vegetarianism. Um, we're a nightmare when they see us coming in together. Oh, should we do an outfit for the night? Or is this not gonna be very good? So this jacket is from Topshop. Um, I get loads of questions on this lace bralette because it's really, really long and it goes with everything. Got it in an outlet actually out here for three dollars from Victoria's Secret. But I went in there the other day and they had no good stuff, so it's very hit and miss. The dress is from Beginning Boutique. And you guys can't see it because there's a silly white thing in the way. Yeah, so it's from Beginning Boutique. It has this little frill to it. It's very, very cute. Um, and then the belt is Zara. So that's the outfit. We had a go, so peace out dudes. See you when I see you. What was I gonna do? Just thought of something and now I can't remember what it was. 
Oh, we're zoomed in again. It's my deal with the zooming in. Hello, everyone. Welcome back. So, this is probably going to go up, not straight away. It is probably when people are going to be extremely confused. Long story short, Disney um, have decided to close the parks here in Orlando and in California. Universal have decided to close the parks. It's something, a precaution that they're, they're doing. I think maybe it's the right thing. Um, I know the UK is kind of dealing with it very differently. So I don't really know what to think. Who's in the right, who's in the wrong, what have you. I think it's all just kind of a process. No one really knows. We've not experienced something like this before to this degree. So everyone's doing their own kind of thing. Thought that was a skunk on the golf course. It's not. That's how bad my eyesight is. I thought I saw a skunk. Sorry, everyone. So yeah, long story short, Disney's closing, Universal's closing. It's closing on Sunday. Today is Friday. We'll still be vigilant. We bring our hand sanitizer everywhere. We bring our wipes everywhere. But yeah, we, we do want to enjoy this holiday, you know, at the end of the day. Start off to um, Hollywood Studios today. Obviously bring you guys with us. Hope that you're all doing well. I hope that you're all safe. I hope your loved ones are safe. I hope that if you get this sickness that, you know, you recover from it and you feel all right in yourself. Um, yeah, and my thoughts go out to everyone. Um, I know that there's certain areas of the world that are really struggling right now, Italy and stuff. So, and I was just there in, in January. So it's just sad, really. Um, and I know the government now kind of saying in the UK that it's kind of just expected that like a lot of people are gonna get it. So yes, anyway, um, I know it's something that I couldn't just not discuss and not bring up. Just wanted to say a few words very, very quickly, but that's all I'm gonna say on it because we wanna have a good time and I want these vlogs to still be fun and uplifting. So I'm gonna get my bum in gear and we need to get out of here. Also outfit of the day, pretty little thing tea, Louis bag. Oh guys, I got this bag at the airport, bought it at the airport and honestly, one of the best bags ever. It's just so practical. Um, I know this bag is quite hard to get hold of, which is weird, because they had one at the airport, which is random. Anyway, and then these denim cut-off shorts, which if you're a bigger girl, uh, like bigger leg legged girl, um, like my thighs are a little bit larger, they're very, very flattering cut and they're top shops. So if I can link them the exact ones, I will. I've just got on my Air Forces that are the custom ones. I'll link the girl that did those below. Um, that's about it. Makeup's very simple. We gotta go catch up with you guys when we get there. So, me and Misha here, I think we thought it was gonna be quiet. We were wrong. Just as busy as it usually is, if not busier. Here is the Hollywood Tower of Terror, which actually neither of us have been on. So, intrigued about this. We think the queues are still gonna be chaotic. But we're gonna go and give it give it our best bet. Young people, Yeah. So, we'll see, we'll see. Very, very excited. I actually really like Hollywood Studios. It's one of my faves, they have some really good rides here. Um, so yes, I haven't been in a really long time. So I think I'm gonna try and go on this ride because we know it's gonna get a really big queue. It's literally my favorite ride, I'm really excited for me to go on it. And then we're gonna go and get ourselves a Starbucks. Oh, very cute. Hello, vlog, so we are here. We went on the Aerosmith ride, it was wild. It is so hot right now, guys. Woo, we're feeling it. Come into like the Star Wars area of the park. So I will show you guys around, I'll spin the camera around. My grandpa actually was a stormtrooper back in the day. So, a little claim to fame there. Some people probably aren't gonna believe me, but he actually was. It's just like an extra, really, because there were so many of them. But still, very, very cool. Hi, Gaga. Hi, Grandpa, if you're watching this vlog. So yeah, I will show you guys what it looks like because it's actually really cool. I'm not a big Star Wars fan, just keeping it real, but still, it's very, very cool. Sorry to anyone that's upset by that, but it is a really cool set. Like, I feel like we're in a movie. We're also roasting toasting. We've got our, our ears on. Here we are. We're gonna try and go on a ride or something, maybe. We need to get some pics, we haven't got any stress. Yeah. Catch up with you guys in a bit. Hello vlog. I don't know if I'm meant to be filming. But we're going on this ride. I can't actually see in front of me. It's Star Tours. This will be interesting. I'm back to the pub in Epcot. We got the little monorail thing. I think not you've monorail. Not monorail. Not monorail. Uh, Skyline. Skyline. And we've come to Epcot. And we've come back to the pub because it is a stunning day. Beautiful weather. Like beautiful weather. So I'm going to get a pim. And we're going to walk around with the different countries. I really like Epcot. I have no idea, but we're going to figure something out. Don't worry. Um, but I really like Epcot. It's very dark. Oh, it's very dark. Oh, thank oh, wow. you. That's lovely. So we're going to walk around. Oh. We're in England in the sunshine. It's the weirdest thing. Sunshine. 
Anyway, um, we'll check in with you guys. I'll show you what's around. We're here in Morocco. We are. I'm going to ask me to do my fanny pack up in a minute. We've just got a bottle of something because honestly, the pair of us are starting to. Fade away. The word? Fade away. I also think the patina on this Louis bum bag is really aging in the sun. So this is the little stand thing here. Very cute with some little shops. And then, should we go in here? Let's go in. Come on. Come on. I'm dragging her around. I'm forcing her. Oh, this is very cute. I feel like I'm in Aladdin or something. Oh God, I hope I don't. I hope that's the right setting. Is Morocco? Yeah, no. Okay. This Super cute. This really makes me want to go to Marrakesh. Yeah, I would love to go to Marrakesh. I'd love to go there. Look at this, stunning, stunning. St oh, this is very cute. Wow. wow, this is actually genuinely quite cute. You could literally, you know that challenge that went around. You're so right. We could have so done yeah, that, pretending that I'm traveling the world. Yeah. Well, I went to Morocco. Super cute. Oh wow, look, you could get one of these little outfits here. Oh look, I have one of these. Do you? Yeah. From, from everyone the... had these trousers, I remember. It was like a big thing. Oh yeah, but then I'm traveling. No, everyone. So, oh, sorry. I haven't spoken to you in a little while. We ended up eventually leaving Epcot. It took us a really long time. Oh, By the way, I'm dressed. We went to <laughs> um, Target. It's wild in there. People are buying so much stuff. It's got a little bit haywire. And then we also ran into... Um, Ulta and I will do a haul with the stuff I bought in Ulta. But we're leaving. We're going out. I seem to have caught the sun a bit on my chest today. Um, this is the outfit of the evening. We're going to STK tonight. Not in love with how this dress makes me feel, but I didn't really bring. Well, there we go. She looks great, guys, doesn't she? Yeah, she's very kind. She's next to me stage right, but you can't see her right now. Because I'm pulling out my wedgie. Oh, anyway, it's from a store in Dubai, if I can link it, then I will. Oh, top, top shoes on. There we go, Bob's your uncle, Fanny's your aunt. This is from... Easier. Have you got passport? Got my passport. We've got to go. This is my makeup. I did this in about four seconds, so... Bye, like guys. See you in a minute. Hello. So, we are here. We're in STK. I really don't know how long I can speak to you guys, because we've got this loud music. But we made it here. Sat up here. We've just got ourselves a glass. Cheers. Something bubbly. Oh. Oh God, um, touch and go. I look like I've got no clothes on. I actually do have clothes on. It's really nice in this bit. I would say if you're going to come, um, personally, I would request to be on the upper tier because the upper tier is like the classic kind of STK vibe. It's very isn't it? STK. Very STK. She is here, by the way. I would actually really match the background. Yes, you do. It's like the classic like white vases and like the floor and yeah. like the lights. It's just very. It like, looks like a miniature version of kind of like the Londony one. It's nice. I'd say it's a little bit more dressy on the upper tier. So if you yeah. want to be. A bit more relaxed, then you have got family. Yeah, I agree. so it's up to you. And outside, obviously. But yes, that's the update. As big as you think it is from the outside. It's cute. Yeah. We've got some bread coming over. We've ordered two drinks. Um, that's what's happening. We're just having a look at the menu. What we would fancy. We're a bit baffled. Uh, making our gins over there. Salad that looks lovely. Yes. What is in that again? Quinoa. I think. So we can both have the salad. Yes. Brilliant. And then we've got tuna tartare over there. And then we've got some lovely bread that looks absolutely delicious. So we're gonna tuck into this. Mm. Oh, my salmon has just arrived. There is a group in the corner. There's a woman. There's a woman. We are joining. Honestly, she's going wild. Thank you. Look at that. Wow. What? Okay, oh, so. God, they're touching, they're touching. Oh, no, no, no. Hang on, hang on, hang on. There you go. <laughs> so, I'm <laughs> just gonna break that a little bit off. Oh, no, it's a tower. It's an avalanche. It's an avalanche. <laughs> We've got a mac and cheese that looks so attractive. I've got no words. We've got some cauliflower here with oh, like. It's like a teriyaki. Oh, no. Really? <laughs> So this is my salmon. My mouth is burning. Really? Hello vlog. So, I've been a bit MIA for the last couple of days. I will update you guys when we get back to the condo or something about everything that's been going on because there's been a lot of dramas. Um, but it's all good. We've come up with some food and I thought I'd show you what we're having. We're at a place called Celebration, which me and my family have been coming here for like so many years since it like first came about because it's owned by Disney. Um, Mm. And it's really, really cute. It's just like got a little lake and like a couple of shops and some nice little restaurants. It's like a tavern thing next door that's really good actually for the evening. And there's like a wine place up there. So like it's really, really lovely. Um, but we're just having a little bit of brunch and breakfast. We're actually probably having more of like a lunch because it's actually nearly two o'clock. Um, I have gone for the French toast as we can see here. 
This actually might even be featured in one of my old American vlogs because I have French toast every time I come here. Hash browns on the side. Misha's got her omelette and everything and a fruit cup. Here she is, enjoying it. We've got some Starbucks and some apple juice. And we're just enjoying ourselves. So I will update you guys on what's been going on, but I'll do that a little bit later on. Throwing it back to the webcam to finish this video out. Um, I kind of feel like I've said all that I needed to say at the beginning. I did want to post this video. I hope some of you found it maybe some light relief with everything that's going on at the moment. I do want you guys to know that, you know, the situation wasn't unfortunately at the severity that it is at now. And, you know, it seems to be getting worse and worse here in the UK. Um, I am at home. I'm staying at home just so everyone knows. Um, but it's just sad, isn't it? It's just really, really sad with what's happening worldwide. Um, and how many people have now been affected by this? I just, yeah, it's it's been a weird few days since coming home. But um, I hope you guys are well. Um, I sent all of my love and well wishes to you guys. I hope you did enjoy this little snippet of my time away. Um, and there will be a new video coming soon. So I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for all of the love and support. And I will see you all in my next one. Bye.